When you first receive your bisque, one of the first things that you want to do is A, make sure you wash your hands with soap and water. Any natural body oils, lotions, or food on your hands coming into contact with your bisque can cause your bit color and your glaze to repel. So wash your hands first. Here are some of the tools that you'll need. A duster brush, a rubber grit scrubber, a synthetic sponge, and we like to use a brush basin with clean, fresh water inside of it. So after your hands are washed, take your bisque out of the box, and first look for any box marks that you might see. Here's a little box mark. It just comes from the cardboard rubbing up against it. And you can just very carefully, see how quickly that comes off? Just spot check so that your bisque is nice and pretty. The next thing you want to do is, using the duster brush, dust off any dust, dirt, or bisque residue. Because whether it just came out of the box or it's been sitting on your shelf for a couple of months, it's going to have one of those on it. And you'll notice here, see what comes off? You'll notice as I dust off all of this dirt, dust, and bisque debris. And you want to get that off because if you don't take it off, then that first coat of glaze is going to be very gritty. So that's all we needed to do. Next, I'm going to take a synthetic sponge and I'm going to get it wet. I'm going to squeeze all the water out of it. We don't want to put a lot of water back into this very porous pottery bisque. And then I'm just going to gently, see I'm not soaking it, gently wipe it off on both sides. And just in a couple of moments that'll all dry away and this piece of bisque will be ready for your glazes.